Hey tubers and pickers, it's Drew the California Picker. Welcome back to my channel, California Pickin. And I might have did a video a long time ago, really in the early stages of my channel. But it was with my old camera and it was really probably pretty bad. So I'm going to do another one, especially for my new viewers. Check it out. This is uh, some incredible 19th century. Hold on a second, it's going to get blurry. And I'll come back into focus a second. Here we go. Sorry about that. There we go. Look at this, you guys. It's a hoard of 19th century glass slides. And this is before Viewmaster or anything else, even probably even before those uh, three-dimensional uh, stereo views that you see. This is probably some of the earliest forms of entertainment through a projector. And I know you guys are going to really just enjoy these because they're just, they're really very, very cool. So let's go look at them. I was just showing you this one. This, uh, this snow scene. Hold on a second. And uh, this, this person's hitting a pipe over here. <laughs> Having a snowball fight. See if we can get some close-ups of these. There we go. Look at the detail. They're all reverse painted on glass. When I say painted, it's some type of an emulsion so that they could run these off in multiples. But uh, the colors are just pretty incredible. And if you were to see the, this uh, projected on the wall or in a screen, you would you would be pretty dazzled and they're all signed with this EP this is the manufacturer and let's go to another one down here shooting at targets right there and uh, no television there weren't movies back then really um, shooting with a bow and arrow or a crossbow really historic 19th century glass viewing slides and then the, these this type of variety had little circles where that was the size, I guess, of the uh, projector lens. And it would project these circles. You wouldn't see the black part. You would just see the uh, these little vignettes. Look at the detail. The seagulls and the... I don't think anyone's ever done a picking video on these. So this has got to be a first. There's a shipwreck right there. Some of them have a little damage like there. Well, on the back side of that one, but let's look at this next one. It also has the... Uh, Look at this guy in the background, check him out. What's he doing back there? <laughs> he looks pretty uh he looks pretty notorious back there checking out the ladies. But uh that one's a little hard to see. Let's go up to the next row up here. Sorry for the shaky shaky camera work. Look at the colors. Look at that blue color. 
of the sky, I guess. I mean, when you put it down, it gets bluer. All signed with this EP. I think at one time I knew who that was. But, uh... Get some close ups of this one. That's in reverse. All the writing would be in reverse because when you would project it, it would come out correctly. Just pretty amazing work artistically. Wow, look at the colors. We're on the Samsung tablet today. It's picking up some nice colors there. In HD this time. It was frustrating because I had a bad camera back then and I didn't really even know how to work it. <laughs> always using the wrong setting or something. There's the EP again. This time the correct in the correct position. Let's go down here. And I guess these were manually slid through a slot and this is how you would see them. I think I'm maybe even going, I'm, I don't know in the direction, I might be going in the wrong direction or because I think these a lot of times told a story. Here we have the, uh, the black circles again. A lot of history with these glass slides. Sorry about that. <laughs> Look at that old tag. Seven... Was that seven cents? Huh. Hold on, let me reposition myself here. I've only seen these a couple times out at the swap meets. I wouldn't say they're super rare, but to have a nice set like this in really good order, pretty good condition with not too much scratch, with not too many scratches is pretty fortunate. Okay, let's go up to the next row. Up here. Sorry, if I if I brought the focus back, if I broke if I brought the focus back, it would uh, actually be pretty blurry and harder. So I just panned like that. Not great, but you get the picture. Look at the furniture. They're in a classroom of some sort, maybe. This is one of my favorite ones. Look at this guy. A frog using a little uh, leaf for an umbrella. Classic. They really are incredible. Each one is just pretty darn cool. This one has an architectural kind of concept to it, theme buildings this 
one's kind of well you got the pyramids in the background that's cool take a look at that one yeah this one's really kind of disintegrating you see the uh, the paint the emulsion is unfortunately disintegrating but uh, yeah quite a collection huh got those a number of years ago never did anything with them they're just cool to look at anyways if you like the video please share on Google Plus Facebook tell your friends about California Picking hit like of course go check out my Facebook page hit like over there the California Picker keep on picking cheers now